Hi, I hope you are doing all right and welcome back again. Uh, today we are going to talk about the new Mac Pro from Apple. Uh, the cheese grater is upgraded with uh, new hardware, new design and a new price. If you don't know, I actually have some background in uh, Apple, uh, in the Apple world. I have used uh, Apple products to produce music. I have also worked as an Apple service technician for about uh, six years, uh, repairing uh, Mac Pros, repairing uh, uh, MacBook Pros, iPhones, yeah, everything from uh, Apple. I don't do it anymore though, but uh, yeah, uh, I have uh, been a part of that. So I uh, I use Apple products myself. I uh, have this uh, uh, this iPhone, which I use to take the uh, thumbnail picture uh, for this YouTube video. I also use uh, a MacBook Pro. When I'm at uh, work, it's my uh, employer that pays f mostly for it, so I haven't, I haven't bought it myself, but uh, but I use it. But when we talk about music production and video recording and recording YouTube videos like this, I don't use a Mac. I use a self-built PC, and I think the release today of, uh, or not release today, but the the release of information about the Mac Pro still validates why I, in, in some cases, want to use a self-built PC for certain tasks. So I thought we could take a look at the, uh, the Apple uh, website and uh, just, uh, just go through the design and the specifications and uh, I will just give you some of my thoughts uh, along the way. So... Uh, yeah, join me if you want. Okay, so uh, when we talk about this design, Apple clearly knows what they are doing. They have taken the old cheese grater design and updated it, added uh, modularity and uh, everything is in steel and aluminium. As we expect, everything here looks uh, pristine on uh, Apple's uh, webpage. Uh, they show the internals, they show the fans, they show the connectors, and it even uh, shows you how uh, the airflow is uh, through the machine. So this is uh, the first uh, stop here, because uh, as you can see here, you have the uh, GPUs, but they are uh, a new type of uh, of uh, GPUs. They are called MPX, and there's it's the form factor Apple have come up with, I think. Uh, they have made it so it uh, so the GPUs here they don't have any uh, internal uh, fans. They use the cabinet fans to cool off the cards. When you think when you think the Mac Pro is expensive, here's one of the reasons why it's expensive. So if you build a Mac Pro from off the shelf parts, you can't go this route. You can't have a specially designed GPU here and this uh, cooling. Then we have the outside of the Mac Pro. It's also a doubles as a heatsink. And they have drilled the holes in a way that makes uh, the airflow optimal. Optional wheels, they will probably cost something. And uh, the display and the stand, we don't have to talk about the stand. I guess you know the price of it already. But if you didn't know, it was 999 Okay, let's go to the next one. Tech specs. So obviously, Intel Xeon CPUs, that's uh, the way to go here. You, we go from 8-core to 28-core. Turbo Bulbs boosts up to 4.4 gigahertz. Memory support is 1.5 terabytes, and uh, it's uh, six channel if I'm not uh, mistaken, but uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, GPU wise, uh, apparently third parties are uh, welcome to design their own uh, or put or design their own MPX modules, as far as I know. But currently we only have uh, AMD offering their uh, Radeon Pro 580X and then the, the Vega GPUs. 
Yeah, you can actually get uh, two GPUs on one of these cards, so you can have four GPUs in one uh, system. And here are some technical specifications you can probably read on the website yourself. The power supply is rated for 1.4 uh, kilowatts, so you can put a lot of uh, stuff in there. PCI Express uh, slots, a lot of them, and then a special afterburner card using an FPGA, so it accelerates uh, ProRes uh, RAW um, editing. And of course, uh, SSD storage using the uh, T2 security chip from Apple. And if you want some additional storage inside of the computer, if you want to use old spinning uh, hard drives, you have the SATA ports here. But at the moment, we only have like a third party uh, hard drive offerings uh, later on. <coughs> but they will probably be sold in the uh, uh, Apple uh, uh, web shop. Then uh, USB A, usual th Thunderbolt ports, and USB C, and uh, 10 gigabit Ethernet. So, yeah, uh, it will also come on wheels, they are optional. And you get uh, the Mac, keyboard, uh, mouse, and the power cable. And that's uh, it, Mac OS, and uh, yeah. So, this is the Mac Pro. Yeah, let's just switch the camera here so you can see my face. So, I am going to buy it. Uh, no. But do I want it? Yes, I want it. But uh, then you think with the brain and then you think with the, with the heart. And the, the brain tells me that this is too expensive uh, for me uh, in my current workflow. So I uh, I am um, I I have to use my PC of course it uh, gives me most value for the money uh, I do not have I do not have that income on my projects that um, can justify the costs of buying a Mac Pro um, even though if I would like to have it it's uh, it's not uh, it's not smart. If I have to use that much money, I would just rather go get a Moog One or some synth or something. With the Mac, it's not easy to um, do uh, things like this. Go down here and uh, start uh, a game. If you like gaming, uh, I am not saying that you can't game on a Mac. You will probably be able to game on a Mac Pro, but that's not the... Uh, that's not the target for Apple. This Mac Pro is uh, Apple. I think Apple, it's meant for real professional movie studio people or real uh, high end music producers. And uh, I think the price uh, really also reflects that. And uh, but that doesn't mean uh, people won't uh, uh, buy it. I think uh, uh, Linus Tech Tips, that's a YouTuber said you're going to buy it and also MK what's this guy called let's see I think uh, yeah this guy is uh, also That's, likes uh, it no word on Nvidia GPUs it has eight PCI slots four full size and then four half size up to four terabytes of SSD storage and a 1400 watt power supply so by the numbers on paper of course we can tell it's a Fascinating in a bunch of ways. Do you know what trep trepophobia is with, with the holes? I don't know about you, but this gets like awkwardly close to that. Just gonna throw that out there. But obviously the main comparison is to a cheese grater, which is the same as that previous Mac Pro that came before the trash can, but I'll take the cheese grater over a trash can any day. So this new- Yeah, uh, as Apple said before, they with the trash can, they designed themselves into a thermal corner. I have actually, uh, I have repaired the trash can for a customer and it's um, yeah it's uh, it's not impossible to to uh, to repair it but uh, to take out all the cards and uh, it's um, 
it's a huge uh, huge uh, manual to read at least i think i think i'm allowed to say that i'm not i'm not sure but yeah anyway new cheese grater is about the size of i guess a, a normal mid-sized tower it's definitely not as big as the old cheese grater but it's way bigger than the trash can, thankfully, and it's all metal as you can see. Those arcs across the top are handles, and there's a third handle in the middle that you can twist, and then there's a graphics card MPX module for ProRes and ProRes. Yeah, so uh, he is uh, talking about what I uh, es essentially talked about earlier here. So yeah, uh, some people buy Rolex watches for 10K, uh, other people buy Mac Pros for 10K, I would like to have one. <laughs> I can't. I can't argue with that. I'll pass on the stand though, and the the, the display maybe. But the um, uh, the uh, tower it looks uh, it looks good uh, uh, besides my uh, speakers here. So yeah, no, uh, I'm just kidding a little bit here. Uh, what do you think? Uh, is this something you are interested in? Is this something you are going to incorporate in your workflows? Um, I have found that um, there's a lot of uh, silent people out there that actually buys uh, things like this and not only uh, huge uh, multinational multi-billion uh, movie studios or music uh, studios. I think a lot of people even though it's uh, this is expensive, I think a lot of people are going to buy it. Okay, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, if you like videos like this, I would appreciate a subscribe. Over 200 subscribers, we are going that way. Maybe set the goal higher, over 500, I don't know. If you like the music I produce, you can uh, support me on Patreon, where you can have uh, tiers, where you can download the uh, music from my uh, Google Drive and uh, and things of that sort. Uh, talk to you later. Uh, take care. Bye bye.